hello everyone oh my gosh it has been such a long time since i last posted a video but i am back i am back with another video if this is your first time stopping by my name is jasmine sheree i am an intuitive messenger and um i do um oracle card and tarot card readings here on youtube i also have a facebook group on um facebook of course energy and fairy dust is the name of the group energy the and symbol fairy dust i put the link in the description if you would like to join us there um so tonight or today whenever you may be watching this video the title of the video is called my money over the next 60 days now originally i was going to hop back into doing my youtube videos and i was going to kick off this week with your weekly message for what you need to know this week uh, for those of you who are familiar with what i do i always do the weekly videos but for some reason this money issue i felt like was kind of urgent like i feel like it's something that needs to be said spirit is speaking now through me to you guys to myself about money and so i really wanted to just get this video out and see what spirit has for you guys um, also, I would like to say that, and I'll talk more about this probably in the video because I'm sure it's going to come up for a lot of you guys in your individual, well not individual, in your group readings 1, 2, or 3. But if you click the link below, I have a link, an affiliate link to a program. Um, the founder of the program is the Budgetista. I'm not sure if you're familiar with her. Her name is Tiffany, um, but she has a... Uh, an, an online academy called the Live Richer Academy and it just has a wealth of information about money it is just your educational playground when it comes to money and finance and if you click that link you can join now um, Monday the 18th through the 24th completely free you will get access to the academy free for 14 days uh, so that you can try it out and see what you like. I've only been in it, I think, now for about three days or four days. And it has just completely given me just so much more clarity and insight. And I feel so much more secure just in these short amount of days. So I highly encourage you to join me. Take this journey with me. Click the link. Get your 14-day trial. If you don't like it, you can bounce. If you do, stick around. And stick around for this video. Without further ado, let's get right into it. So, we're going to do my money over the next 60 days. Here's pile number one, pile number two, pile number three. I don't have them clarified with anything today. So, kind of just pick the, the card that speaks to you. Pick the one that you're drawn to the most. The energy that you feel the most. We have one, two, and three. I'll give you a moment to do that. Just take a deep breath, close your eyes, ground yourself and ask spirit which card is for you. And you can pick one, two, or three. Okay, hopefully you've made your decision. If not, you can pause the video. So let's get right into it. I will move two and three slightly to the side. Okay. <clears throat> so number one, let's see what we have. Your money over the next 60 days. So the first thing you have is the six of wands. And I'm going to be pulling more cards for you from the tarot deck as well as the oracle deck. Um, the fairies deck. The magical messages with the fairies deck by Doreen Virtue as well as the mystic fairy tarot deck um by Linda so we'll get into more of it um so you, you're starting off here group number one with the six of wands um this speaks to me this is saying to me that um It feels as though I'm getting the sense that you are sort of alone in this journey, this financial journey. So this could be you may be single or you may be with the person who 
maybe they don't share the same values as you about money or like I said in the beginning you could be single or it could just be that your values or your viewpoint your understanding now is different from the way that you were brought up so there's nobody really around you um who has this understanding that you have basically and you may have accomplished some things recently or you may be on the brink of accomplishing some things um and it's sort of like it's like an you're, it's like you're an island right you're you're not so much of an isolation though some of you could be isolated from people but it's just that it's so different from anything that you've ever known or or were were shown or were taught and so when you have that sort of energy or possess this sort of knowledge um, you know, certain people can look at you like, oh, he think he doing something. She thinks she doing something. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, um, people are watching you, whether you know it or not from afar. And it may not always be good energy because some people can be hating. But that's neither here nor there. It really isn't that big of a deal. The importance is that you need to continue to keep your eye on the prize, no matter if people agree with you or not, no matter if people see things the way that you see them or not, no matter if people are with you or not. You are on a journey of transformation. You are on a journey of eradication, of eradicating limiting beliefs from your life. And this is for you. And once you get this information, this download, you'll be able to live a more free and creative life. And then also help other people to do the same thing. So it's important that you stay focused and stay grounded. You don't have to take everybody with you. Okay? The importance is that you be the light. You need to remember that, that you are the light. You are your own light. And you're going to help be light for other people. Let's see what up spirits have for you for your money over the next 60 days. What do you have for group number one, Ferris? For that money over the next 60 days. Um, <laughs> it's like they're peeking out. A lot of cards are peeking out, but not falling out. You got strength, you got temperance, you got king of wands. So, okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. That card may be in reverse. All right, so we have, oh, child, please. You got the star. I'm trying to get it in good focus. Oh, no, it didn't. And then you got the Six of Pentacles. Six of Pentacles is about re being resourceful, gathering your resources. Again, I told you, this is a time of focus. You need your focus and determination over the next 60 days. You are going to be receiving downloads, information. You, yourself, you're on the brink of something. There's some sort of accomplishment, a milestone, a breakthrough. You can see it right here. With the Six of Wands. You got the Six of Wands and the Six of Pentacles. You can see it here. Um, this this fairy or this, this person in this card. Um, or this, yeah, this guy. He's, um, he's cracking this thing open over his head, which is symbolizing an accomplishment. And you see this person to the side is kind of standoffish and kind of just, you know, just observing, you know, speculating. Um... So you're on the brink of breaking through something, minor or large, um, however it applies to your situation. And so it is a time for you to be resourceful so that you can gather all the necessary information that you need to make this journey successful. So right now you are gathering your resources. You need to realize how resourceful you are again, guys. Again, as I stated in the beginning of the video, I posted the link below in the description to join the Live Richer Academy for 14 days free. You can try it out. Again, this is a money academy. This is going to walk you through A through Z of finance. This is um, Tiffany. I forget her last name or how to pronounce her last name, but you've seen the budget nature. You've seen her um, on The Real. You've seen her on, you know, different talk shows. Um, I think I've heard her on um, Steve Harvey Morning Show before. 
Um, the Budgetista is what she goes by. She has an academy called the Live Richer Academy. I just recently joined um, right now, Monday, November 18th through November 24th. You can join 14 days for free and try it out. You're going to learn about how to create budgets for yourself um, on low income to high income. You're going to learn about investing. You're going to learn about building credit. All of these resources that are important, especially if you did not come from an upbringing of financially literate people. We need to educate ourselves. I was just talking to a friend the other day and we were talking about how you know, our parents and their parents, they didn't know what they didn't know, right? And now we are the generation, we are aware of what we don't know when it comes to finance. And so then now we can go out and seek this information. And so this, this uh, program for a lot of you is going to be some of, one of the resources that are coming to you that you need to grasp onto at this time to take your life to the next level. So I invite you to click the link, join for 14 days, give it a test run to see if it works for you, if it's going to be a fit for you in your life. Um, and it's really affordable. I think I, um, I'm paying $29.95 or something like that a month. I just joined a few days ago, so I paid my first $29. But you don't even have to do that. You're going to try it out completely free for 14 days. Um, and there's a number of different packages and, you know, subscriptions that she has, different pricings. So you pick what works for you after the 14 days. Then you have number one is the star card. That this card is so powerful. It's so even now as I talk about it, if I feel like it's just calming me down because it's just it's that surety. That card it's a card of surety. So this is a sure thing for you, this accomplishment, this this elevation, this new lifestyle is is sure. And spirit wants you to really get into flow, get into deep belief about that and about what I'm speaking to you. As this water is flowing in this image, so will abundance, wealth, prosperity flow to you and through you. Right now it is a learning time. You are on the brink of accomplishing something and you need to apply yourself. But in a gentle way, like allow the information to come to you. Pay attention to the teachers and the messages and the signs that you are going to um, come across and experience over the next 60 days financially. So right now for you, there's a breakthrough on the brink for you over the next 60 days. You need to gather your resources. You need to protect your energy. You don't need to worry about who agrees with you, what you didn't know. It doesn't matter because now we are aware of what we don't know. We're going to gather our resources and we are going to make shifts and changes in our lives. Okay, number ones, that's what spirit has for you about your money over the next 60 days. Great positive energy. I hope you can pick up on what I'm saying. Leave your comments below if you have any questions or concerns. And I'll see you next video. All right. Number twos, let's see what we have for you. The Knave of Wands. The Knave of Wands. Spirit, what are you speaking to number twos about the Knave of Wands? There's a, hmm. I'm hearing the word empathy. A message about empathy. What are you speaking, Spirit? Um... Empathy. Number twos. What are you dealing with number twos? I want to say sad, but I'm not really feeling like... Maybe this is for some of you. Maybe that's what it is. It's probably about 30% of you. You may be in a situation where you're feeling a bit sad for some reason. And spirit is wanting to provide you some sort of um, confirmation or comfort right now instantly for some reason. Um... There's something that you are contemplating. Somebody is wanting confirmation for something at this time. A spirit is confirming to you um, right now. That it is okay. Something about empathizing. And maybe you need to be more empathetic to other people around you as well. Um... 
Then for the rest of you, I feel as though um, swift changes are coming in for some of you. Um, messages, again, like group number one, there are messages coming in for a lot of you. And when I say messages, I mean you're going to be picking up on insights. This can be from books. This can be from signs. You may start to see a lot of synchronicities, a lot of angel numbers. 88, 888, that's the number of abundance. Um, you may begin to see things of that nature over the next 60 days. Just pay attention to the signs and the messages that are coming through for you. I feel that some of you are getting an email or a phone call that is going to be um, a positive message. You're um waiting on some sort of message that message is coming through for you is going to create a lot of movement and a lot of action for you with this knave of wands energy the knaves in the tarot deck are sort of they're young they're innocent they um they are they can um you know absorb a lot of information um and so there's something new, right? It's something new and innocent and fresh about it. So there's some sort of new or fresh information that you're waiting to receive. You're going to get that email or that phone call over the next 60 days. Um, I'm feeling for a lot of you even within the next 30 days. So something really soon that's going to create a lot of movement for you. Some For some of you, this is a job, a new job. A new offering that is coming in for a lot of you. Um, however... For those of you who are getting this new job, I am feeling for some of you, you need to be more active in the pursuit of it. Um, so as you wait, you will get the results that you want, but you have to put in the effort um, to bring it about. You can't get the call or the email if you had not put in the application or if you hadn't done the interview. It doesn't make sense. And for some of you, this job, this is going to be like career shifting for you. It's something different for you. Um, it's, um, for some of you, this is a, a a job that you didn't think you would necessarily get. So you haven't put in the effort to try to apply for it, but you need to do so. For others of you, it's just something that you simply need to do for the time being. And you just need to put the effort in to bring it about. Point blank and the period. Let's see what else to Tara has for you. What else do you have for group number two for their money over the next 60 days? Yes. What do you have for group number two for their money over the next 60 days? Okay. What else? Anything else for group number two for their money over the next 60 days? I don't know if one well, of Six of Swords. Keep your eye on the prize. Six of Swords. Um, child, please. What did I just say? That's the Ace of Pentacles right there. Ace of Pentacles is new, fresh beginnings. The Pentacles is the money card. The money cards. It is the tangible things. It is the... um. How can I say this? This is career. This is finance. This is um. Creativity. This is also health. Some of you are beginning a new health journey. Um, but the most important thing, the, the, the main point is that there's a new fresh beginning, as I was just saying, with that Knave of Pentacle, the Knave of Wands card. You're receiving this new information, this email, this text message, this phone call. There's a new start. Again, for a lot of you, you need to put forth the effort to bring this about over the next 60 days. But Spirit is confirming that if you do this, we will do our part in making it a sure thing. Keep your eye on the prize. That's the Six of Wands card. If you, I don't know how clearly you can see it, but in the backdrop... You can see the castle, and you can see that the fairies are um, looking towards the castle, right? The castle is at a distance, but they have their eye there, and they are journeying through. You need to keep your eye on the prize, because for a lot of you, sometimes we feel as though we don't want to take a regular job, especially when we're more creative, right? Um, 
we don't want to we need to free we need to be free we need to free ourselves so that we have the energy to work our gift but you still have rent you still have all of these other things that spirit wants to help provide for you you need to tap into that resourcefulness and go after what it is that you want while still keeping your eye on the prize when i first moved to la i moved to la to act that is my passion acting is my passion i did not accept the job i wouldn't accept the nine to five i wanted to be free i wanted to work my gift i wanted to work my craft and what i ran into was burnout i was burnt out because i kept taking all of these odd jobs just random odd jobs because i needed to free my time to act right and what it ended up what ended up, i have no money i couldn't go to my acting classes i wasn't able to um do my workshops and all of the things that I need to do for the sake of quote unquote what I thought was freedom, right? So I had to shift. If this is something that I want to do, even YouTube and my in my videos and I want to buy more, you know, card decks and things of that nature. If those are my goals, that's my vision, that's my castle. And I currently don't have the means to see that through in the way that I want to. Am I really in service to my creativity, my dreams, my spiritual gifts? Am I really in service to that? So I had to reshift and rethink what I was doing at the time. I had to shift my energy. All right, if I am to get a job, this is the kind of job that I want. So I had to get really specific to spirit about what kind of job, what type of work I would be willing to accept. Right? So currently I have a job. I like the job. The job is great. Um, my efforts and my hard work is being realized by the higher ups. Um, it's a fun job. There's always fun activities that we do. Um, they're always feeding us something. Right? You know what I'm saying? So it's, 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 it's good energy. I don't feel drained. It's not something that I go to when I dread getting up every morning to go. And I still have my dreams. I still have my goals. I still have my passion. My eye is on the prize. Because now I have the financial means. Right? To do those things. I just got my new tripod. You know what I'm saying? So it's like you have to have a honest and true conversation with yourself about what it is that you're trying to accomplish and what resources are around you to aid you in that right i'm not saying go work a job that you hate because we don't want to do that because if you're going to work and you're dreading it every day that's also total opposite of you keeping your eye on the prize right so you got to make sure that you're in alignment alignment is key guys but keep your eye on the prize nonetheless it even for some of you i mean it, this fresh start, this new beginning, this email, this offering, this could be something really, really huge. This may not even be, you know, a job, particularly a, a nine to five in a traditional sense. But this could be something that you're really hoping for. Um, or not, uh, maybe you've booked an audition or something like that, but you're psyching yourself out. And also, I'm here for some of you, a lot of you creative people. Um, you are... Um, your auditions do not define who you are as a creative being, as an artist. You are the artist first. And that's the shift that you need to make within your mind in order to keep your eye on the prize. You walk into the audition as the thing already, as the artist, as the actor, as the dancer, as the model, as the whatever the case may be, as the singer, as the rapper, whatever. You walk into that space as that being already. So you're not walking into an audition um, asking for an opportunity to be an actor. You're walking into the audition as an actor already first looking for an opportunity to be able to act. To, to get to, as the actor, to be able to express that gift and express that talent. So, but you are the being of the thing first. And you need to have that, um, for some of you, you creative people, you need to have that mentality shift at this time. So that these new opportunities can flow to you.
Because when you, when you understand that, when you walk into a space as the thing that you are, you, it's a different aura around you, right? It's a different energy that you bring, and people naturally gravitate towards that thing. Even for entrepreneurs, a lot of you are entrepreneurs who may be watching, be you are the, the boss already, right? You are your own boss already. So you need to embrace that energy first. A lot of you are scared to make get on calls with clients. You're scared to send pictures out. You already are the thing. You do not need validation on the other side. The email is not validation. You, the boss, the entrepreneur, that energy, that knowing is what magnifies and magnetizes whatever it is that you're seeking towards you. It doesn't happen the other way around. You don't get the audition. You don't get the client. You don't get the booking, right? And then feel as though you are the actor. You are the boss. That energy has to switch. You have to be the thing first, okay? Again, I invite you guys to click the link um, for the Budget Nista's um, Live Richer Academy. It is an academy, the A to Z of money. How to budget, how to create a successful budget on a fixed income, how to create a budget on an irregular income. That's for a lot of you creatives and a lot of you um, entrepreneurs. Um, credit building, wealth building, real estate, investing, cryptocurrency, everything. What The resources that we need is what is provided in this academy. So I highly encourage you guys to click the link. It's a 14-day trial you'll get from this Monday, November 18th through the 24th. If you click the link, you'll get 14 days free. Now, if you click the link after the 14, uh, after the 24th, um, you will just have to pay for whatever the um, packages and th different things that she has. So there's $29 plans. There's you can pay it up for six months. How, you know, whatever the case may be. But I highly encourage you to join me on this money journey. So anyway, again, for you guys over the next 60 days, number twos. You are going to receive some sort of um, messages, emails, phone calls, um, but you need to keep your eye on the prize. Got it? Got it. Okay, number threes. Let's see what we have here for you. I am thirsty. Honey, all right. I forgot the um. Never mind. All right. Ooh, okay. Number three is you're kicking it off with the nine of pentacles. Nine of pentacles. Okay. What I'm feeling right now, number three is a lot of you. Okay. So number twos were sort of starting a new journey. Similar to number ones. But number ones are a little further along, I believe. But you guys, number threes, are even further along. You have the nine of pentacles. Ten is the completion. You're at the nine mark. So, you have been worried. You are wondering, have you done enough? Are you, have you, Spirit wants you to know you are exactly where you need to be. You can enjoy the fruits of your labor You've put in the work, you've studied, you've done the course. You are continuing on that journey. You are perfectly where you need to be. Spirit is going to meet you where you are to provide you what you need. And you need to be in a state of trust because when you are in that deep state of trust, you can rest and know for sure that Spirit is going to take care of you and provide for you. You can enjoy it. You can enjoy where you are in life. And you need to enjoy number three is where you are in life right now. Over the next 60 days, can you just flow and trust that spirit is providing? That you, you don't need to beat yourself up and worry. Have you done enough? What more can you do? Let spirit bring that information to you. But just know that you, well done. Well done. All right, let's see what else. <clears throat> The fairies have for you. Wait a minute now. There's a card. Okay. 
Fairies, what do you have for group number threes for their money over the next 60 days? What do you have for group number three for their money over the next 60 days? What do you have for group number three for their money over the next 60 days? Wait a minute. Oh my gosh, all these nines. Nine of swords. Okay. Oh God, there's that worry. Come on, that number three. Just, we have to put number three for their money over the next 60 days. Yep, the hermit. Okay, so I don't know what you're worried about, and I don't know why you're putting that much stress and constraint on it, but you really need to relax. This Nine of Wands is the card of entrapment. Um, however, you have the ability to free yourself from that entrapment. That that mental, uh, the swords is this mental energy. You you mentally is overload. It's just too much going on mentally. You need to rest and retreat. That's why this hermit card came up. The hermit card, the hermit goes within. The hermit possesses the wisdom and the knowledge within, right? The hermit can somewhat sometimes be sort of isolated and distant. And right now you need to be distant from even your own negative thoughts. You need to break free from that. Trust the inner wisdom and the inner guidance that spirit is providing for you. Even right now as I speak, you need to free yourself mentally and know that spirit is with you, providing for you and the information that you need. Again, like I've been telling everybody, I knew this was going to happen. I knew that's why I needed to do this video. Because for all of you guys, I invite you to click the link below and join me in the Live Richer Academy. The founder is the Budanista. You've seen her on The Real. You've, you've heard her on Steve Harvey Morning Show. Right now, if you click the link between... Today, the 14th through, I mean, today, the 18th through the 24th, November 2019, guys, if you're watching this now, you will get access to this academy 14 days completely free to try it out. It is just the perfect resource right now that's going to help to elevate you and to free you from that stress, right? Because sometimes we, 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 we could be so hard on ourselves, especially when it comes to finances, especially when we have huge dreams and we know that we want more out of life. It's like, okay, what else can I do? What am I doing wrong? Spirit wants you to stop asking that question, what am I doing wrong? And start to get into this energy of what can I do right? See, that's a, that's a mentality shift. That's a different question. It possesses a different energy and it provides a different answer. And since I've been in this course, since I've been in this academy, taking these different courses, I've gained so much information already that I'm just, I'm trying to tell everybody about it. So I invite you to do the 14-day trial right now. Um, if you don't like it, if you feel like it's not for you, then hey, don't do it. But you need to free yourself from this mental anxiety and fear. A lot of you are so fearful of the future, but the future is so perfect for you. You're going to be able to enjoy the fruits of your labor. A lot of you have already put in a lot of effort. Right now, you need to just chill. Just chill. Mentally, you need to chill. This is the mental group right here. Mentally, it's just too much going on in your head right now. You're trying to figure it all out. We only can do so much. We only can do... We only can... We receive information and downloads, and we have to take inspired action, right? But in order to take that inspired action, you have to be in a place to receive the inspiration. You understand what I'm saying? So you have to embrace the the down the downtime, that hermit energy. You got to go within to hear from yourself and to hear from spirit. If you're too much in your head space... Or in your head space, there's too many opposing thoughts. It creates confusion within yourself and then confusion in your reality.
confusion is what will be your direct experience. So you got to find a way to unwind and retreat. Free yourself from that entrapment because it's not really real. Everything that we feel is not necessarily real just because we feel it. Right? At the end of the day, it's a feeling in and of itself. And we can switch it. We can change it. We can change our thoughts. And we can change our feelings. And we can change our reality, ultimately. That's the power that we have. So I really, I mean, I just to help you to, to see, to get a clearer sense of where you are financially, I highly encourage you to click that link. Uh, one of the first courses um, in the group is the how to create a budget on any income. I highly recommend you just start there and pick up on the clarity there. Right? Since I, I watched one of her, I watched her promotional video on Facebook and then I've taken two of the, um, I watched two videos in the academy already. And I can honestly say that I've already applied some of the steps. And I, it's not much, but my bank account, I see extra money already. And I'm like, wait a minute now. But it's giving me such a sense of, of peace. You understand what I'm saying? And with peace comes freedom. With freedom comes financial freedom. With financial freedom comes a financial life. A financial a free life. So you need to free yourself, number threes. You, you, you're, you're doing well. You understand that? You're doing well. Okay. I was supposed to pull from the Oracle deck, but I didn't do it for group number one. I forgot to do it for group number two, so I guess it's not meant to be in this particular reading. But that's what spirit wants you to do over the next 60 days. Can you just trust a bit more? Can you trust a bit more that spirit is going to provide for you financially? You're doing well. You need to get be more in, in your intuitive space over the next 60 days financially. Follow your intuitive inspired leads. Right now, if you're feeling, if when I speak about the budget needs and I speak about this academy, if you're feeling intuitively like this is something that's going to be great for you, follow that hunch. Click the link. Click the link. You have nothing to lose over the next 14 days. You're not even investing one penny. She's created it. She's created an affordable academy. I highly suggest you take advantage of the free 14 days. And, um... Leave your comments below. Let me know if the reading resonates with resonated with you. Um, and I will see you guys next video. Thank you guys for tuning in. Um, have a good night if you're watching this at night. Have a good morning if you're watching this in the morning. Have a great rest of the day if you're watching this midday. Like, comment, subscribe, please. Invite a friend, tell a friend to tell a friend. Thank you.